Well, hello everyone and welcome back to Outward. So, uh, where we last left off, I haven't really gone anywhere. <laughs> uh, we are on the other side of Ghost Pass. So let's take a quick look. Uh, this is Ghost Pass here. Um, normally we, we spend all our time roaming around over here and up here, but uh, we haven't had an opportunity to take a look up here. And in order to get into this area, you do have to go through the Ghost Pass to get here. As far as I can tell, I have probed a little bit around and, and I can't see any other way, but that's okay. It looks like there might be, well, we could get into that later. But uh, the point is we are now over here. I have a bit of a problem in that I am low on food. Uh, so we're going to have to do a bit of foraging. Now, I, I think we did look around, but I'm going to do, I'm going to do it anyways. We're going to poke around in this new area and we're going to explore it and see what, what all there is. is to, yeah, see, we already hit up this, this bad boy here, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, as I say, I'm not sure. I, I didn't, uh, I forgot to review my last, <laughs> Uh, I usually do, uh, but we're, we're just going to be complete anyways. Now, we, did we get you already? Yeah, we already got you. And then there's nothing here. I think we did a cursory um, review of the immediate area, and then I called it, I think. Oh, look at that. There's lots of stuff to look around at here. Okay, now, can I get up on that second floor? Oh, is there anything in the bones? No. I do have to be careful. I don't know what kind of bad guys I'm going to run into over here. Here, let's uh, we're, I, I, like I said, food is an issue. So let's grab, uh, let's grab food that we can. And I'm going to probably have to like cook, get some fish. I think there's some water. Uh, yeah, there's water here. I can maybe do some fishing, uh, build ourselves back up a bit, get some supplies, and and then we can do a little bit of an investigation of what this area is. What's going on over here? Uh, is there anything over here? Is this, what is that? Is that crab eye again? Oh my God. Well, just grab it. Why not? Uh, that's salt. Do I have any salt on me? No. Let's just grab it just in case. Uh, we've got a crap ton of it back at the base, but, um, you know. Oh, wow. That was, and a gravel beetle. Ha, totally worth it. Okay. We're just going to try and be a little bit thorough about, what is that? What is that? What is that? Oh, that's just a shadow. Okay. Oh, hey, there's a little, uh, there's a chest over there. Nice. Oh, I love the music. Do, 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 <laughs> do. Uh, it's a great soundtrack, I tell you. All right. We can always dump stuff if we don't want it, but I might as well gather things. Hey, I got a spice beetle, too. And we got, ah, what the hell? We'll take that. We got some traps. Traps are always handy. Now, let's see what we're dealing with. Doesn't look like there's any mantis shrimp. See, often in this whole area here, like when it looks like this, I often think I'm gonna... No, we don't need any more crab eye. But we will get this uh, gab berry. There we go. And, uh, but, and we'll check out the water down here. We need fish. I'm gonna have to do some cooking. Is that another ghost eye plant over there? I think it is. All right, there's gotta be some fish along the water here. Oh, seaweed. Seaweed's good. Now, I don't have a cooking pot, so there's certain things that I'm not going to... There we go. Hey, guys. Would you like to come with me? Yeah. I figured you would. Um, more seaweed. There we go. And any more fish? Ah, yes. Right here. Excellent. Do, 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 do. Oh, look at that. Doesn't that look spooky? Yeah, see, there's the there's Montcalm over there. That's the, the bandit fort. And then there's, like, some sort of a... It, it, I don't know. It, it doesn't really say... Any, it's ancient ruins. That's what it says. Don't know anything about it. Oh, and we got some rain. Okay, well, that's not good. That is not good. Let's see if there's any more uh, resources that we can gather. Oh, there's a... We can go down to the water over there, but I don't think we can do any more over here. So let's head on over. Now, is there traps? Sometimes these bridges have traps on them. And they freak me out. I'm not seeing any bandits. Why are there no bandits? I mean, I'm not complaining. Oh, hey! Oh! Oh, that's not a good sign. Okay. That's... That's... That's that's definitely... Any Anything down here? Any fish? 
No? All right. That's cool. That's fine. That's fine. But we will go get that ghost dye plant. Oh, we're right here. Yes. Get some seaweed. If I had a cooking pot, I could make, like, a fantastic meal. But I don't. So, oh, azure shrimp. And blue sand. Oh, oh. And give me your eye, ghost. There we go. And an ochre spice beetle. Cool, cool. All right. Now, what are we dealing with up here? Oh! I think those are called horrors. Look at how there's like one, two, three of them at least. Holy moly. Okay, that is that is that is bad news. I don't do well against those things. Here, let's let's approach this over. Hopefully this this is a little bit less. I mean, we could always run past them. That's not a big deal, but I'm trying to uh gather some food so I can be able to eat uh at some point. Because I am hungry, and I will be third. Oh, you know what I didn't do? Um, I didn't gather water. Let's go gather some water before we get too far away from the... Uh... Nothing's following me, is it? No. Okay. Yeah, let's go gather some water before we get too far away from the... Uh, from Well, from the water. <laughs> the water water. Um, oh, can I not gather water here? Really? Okay. Do I have to go to the other side? Wait a minute. Didn't Wasn't there a little place I could go down to the water over here? Yeah, let's go down here. I should be able to gather some water. Gather river water. Okay. I want to not hold F. I just want to do F. There we go. Now, I do have... This is uh, water. Okay. And then this is clean water. And this says it's river water. All right, so we have almost a bag of clean water, and we've got a full bag of river water. All right, we'll have to deal with that. Uh, any? Oh, fish. There we are. Oh, my harpoon is badly damaged. That's okay. That's okay. Uh, I probably should have gone to bed uh, with it. Uh, equipped and set to repair at some point. I'll have to do that. But for now, I'm not going to worry about it. So, oh, see, now we're getting that the music. The, oh, it's like warning, sad music that makes me uh, always concerned when I hear it. So we'll get some wood. And let's take a look and see. Is there any butterflies? I don't see any butterflies yet. Looking for... There we go. That's the music I want to hear. That's the happy music. That that makes me pleased. What is all up there? Look at that. There's like a wall. And... Oh, hey. Is this... A mineable? Yeah. Okay. I know I seem to be do sort of going around in circles, but I am just trying to get a f good feel for this place and, and see what there is. Okay. What what's all about? What it's all about? Can I get to it from over here? No. What is going on with this? Oh oh okay. Some of these have weird hit boxes. Um, I'm gonna take the bandages, and the I'm gonna leave. Well, what's my inventory like right now? Uh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. What are my arrows? Arrow supply is good. I'm going to leave that alone because I, it's not going to be of any use to me. And I'll try to remember to pick all that stuff back up on the way out. If Assuming that we head out the same way we came in, which I don't actually know. Yeah, look at that. That looks really cool. It, As I say before, it, it kind of looks like a Thunderbird, like a totem. Very cool. Okay. And then there's, oh, there's something. What is that over there? Oh. oh, and there's more, uh, there's more, like, uh, beach down there. Cool. Oh, and I still haven't, unless I'm missing it, I still haven't seen any butterflies. Look at this. Oh. It's very inviting. <laughs> I'm going to do it. I'm going over. <laughs> I don't know what's here, but... Uh, I don't know if I want to investigate 
too closely before I get uh, prep up some food and stuff like that. It looks like there's some chests in there. Okay, okay, okay. Wait, 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 wait. Mansion cellar. Okay, so it's a dungeon. Oh, okay, we got to check this out. We got to check out the mansion cellar. That sounds awesome. Is there anything up here, though? Is there, before we move on? Doesn't look like it. I don't think I'm missing anything here. All right, before we go down into the mansion cellar, which I would like to do, um, yeah, I don't see anything. Yeah, I know I'm sort of all over the place here. Uh, I do want to... I do want to do some cooking, so and uh, on that sort of thing. So, let's set up a let's set up a campfire. Um, let's make a little do 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 campfire craft. Go back into here and uh, yeah, I know I'm really slow with this. I can I, I just don't see things. It for some reason it just to me the interface. In some ways it's super simple, but in other ways it's just kind of cluttered. I know it's excuses, but that's okay. All right, so what we're going to do is um, we're just going to cook up some of the fish that we've got because that's pretty well the only thing that we have right now, and uh, I think that'll that'll be fine. Is there anything else I can do? Uh, I've got gabberry bread. Um, I can't... Can you cook a gabberry? Will quickly rot unless cooked. Oh, it does boiled gabberries. Uh, a bit of nutrition and rots more slowly. Yeah, I'm not really worried about that. Let's, let's let's go back. Is there anything else? Azure shrimp, uh, eaten raw, coveted by fishermen. Well, you know what? Let's just cook. Let's just. Oh, you can't. Okay. How about if I do this? Oh, you can. Boiled azure shrimp added to the recipe. <laughs> it's not that complicated, guys. Seriously. Uh, crab eye. You know what? I'm gonna just leave it at that. <laughs> but mostly, what it is. Oh, can I not? Do I need a cooking pot in order to do my water? I think I... Oh, no. Here we go. River water. All right. We want to craft uh, clean water. That's what I was basically... That was really what I wanted to get into. Uh, I needed... Uh, this is clean water and clean water. So I, I needed to get some clean water happening. We only have one life potion left. So we're living, living dangerously. I do have survivor elixir, which... Uh, that's a stamina thing. But I do have... Um, Wait a minute. I thought I had... Oh, did I run out? I don't have gebs. Oh, I don't have any gebs left. Okay. But I do have this, uh, grilled salmon. So I'm going to eat that because right now my food... I am thirsty and my food is still quite low. So I'm going to have another bit of fish. And then uh, maybe... What is it? This one? Okay, food's at 100%. So we're good on that front. Let's have a bit of water and maybe a bit more water and we're good okay and i've got i've got plenty of water left so we'll just leave that burning why because we're not very very uh, environmentally friendly all right so um let's go take a look down here i have no idea this <laughs> i have no idea what i'm walking into but i figured you know what we're gonna check it out uh, because. <laughs> Ooh, okay, okay, okay. Now, uh, I'm not going to be foolish enough to uh, not be prepared. So let's do that and that. And then what do I have available to me at this point in time that we could make use of? You know, um, I think just for kicks and giggles, I'm going to be a little... Oh, that that's that doesn't look good. Um, oh, no, 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 oh, no, 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 oh, I didn't even get a chance to move, I had the, <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> where am I going to end up, they basically just, they just, they, they got at me from both sides, um, oh, Okay, you can't stand anymore. The very act of breathing is becoming difficult. Pain racks your body as your consciousness fades. Um, you wake into the... Oh, the Huntress from Sierzo pouring water in your mouth. <laughs> I'm back in Sierzo. 
Okay. <laughs> oh, jeez. Well, that's one way to get home super quick. <laughs> uh, there's my bag. Okay, let's grab that. Uh, turn off the lantern. And I am in rough shape. Um, oh, wow. This is, this is absolutely terrible. Uh, so we're going to have to head back out there because um, I need to continue this investigation. Is there something you need? I want to buy. Uh, actually, what I want to do is I want to sell things like this, and I want to sell the Rondell dagger, and I don't know what else I've got. I've got like a bunch of mana stones. No, we're going to sell that, and that, and the pressure plate because I can't use it. I don't know how. Um... I'm going to keep some of this stuff. I mean, we could sell the shrimp because I don't... That was just emergency food. And uh, we can sell the grilled salmon. And the Gatberry wine, it is... Reduces the mana cost. Oh, yeah, let's just sell that. I mean, we could, we're we getting some cash out of this, 130. It's It'll help us in the long run. My harpoon is in serious trouble. Uh, Golem elixir, it, it uh, temporarily weapons impact... Discipline. I'm going to hang on to that because I think that might come in useful in a fight. And I think that's it. That's pretty well... Uh, let's get rid of the scrap. I've got a bunch of it back at the thing. Oh, and the Hackmanite. Um, you know what? Yeah, we're just going to sell it. I think it... And But we're going to keep the blue sand. Well, I don't know if there's any... Th yeah, yeah, yeah. We're going to keep the blue sand because it's kind of hard to get. However, the ghost eye... I'm going to sell the ghost eye. There we go. Confirm. <laughs> Okay. And then we're going to... Let's just... You know what? I'm going to regroup back at the base. And I'm going to... Uh, oh, yeah. See, I'm in, I'm in rough shape. I'm going to maybe do up some proper food and uh, all that kind of stuff. So uh, let, me, let me take care of that. And then uh, I think what I'll do is I'll probably pick right back up again... Um, just on the uh, the far side of Ghost Pass. Unless something exciting happens. If something exciting happens, then I'll probably um, I'll probably yeah I'll 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 jump in at that point. All right. Um, see you in a bit. All right. Well, welcome back. Oh, by the way, um, here, let me just take a look at something here. I I get the feeling that winter is coming to the Sherson East because. Uh, the gabberry bushes are turning brown, and some of the, the the trees are turning yellow. So I'm I'm thinking we're in for winter. Uh, I'm wondering when. Oh, hey, that ghost plant has respawned. Uh, I'm thinking I don't. Well, I don't know when. I don't know when that's going to happen. But actually, you know what? Let's double check and see if this has respawned as well. There's a no. Is it here? I can't remember. Oh, hey, we got eggs too. Oh, wow. Um. Geez, it hasn't actually been that long since I've been through here, I don't think. I'm actually surprised by this whole thing. Okay, let's go over here. So yeah, um, I'm not going to dilly-dally too much. Um, we, I could probably hit up a few, couple of these things. Let's just get these, uh, the ghost plant. Okay, this one. Oh, this one has. Okay, okay. Wait, now, which, which one has the... There's a chest out on a balcony. That one right there. Okay, just for kicks, I want to go and see what's in that chest. Um, I can't actually remember. Did I use this chest as a dump chest? Ugh, maybe. Maybe I did. Maybe I didn't. Okay, it's empty. Then there we go. So some of it's respawned, some of it hasn't. All right. I, I thought I'd come back for the run through Ghost Pass because this might uh, might be interesting. This is the first time I'm actually hitting up Ghost Pass since uh, we were here. Since I cleared it. Well, I didn't clear it 100%. Uh, oh, right, right, right. Looter, armor, and arrows. Yeah, I don't need it. I still don't need that. Um, oh, there's another one of those monsters pinned to the wall over there. Okay, so stamina has come back. Good. All right. Now, I should be able to just zip over to the right. I think it's either... Well, let's, let's, take, let's get a feel for this when we get in here. I'm thinking... I'm thinking, oh yeah. Yeah, see the dude's in the middle there, and he's kind of locked behind a gate. There's, that dude's dead, but there's a thing behind him. And then I think I should, there's a shovel there. I should be able to just bypass that whole situation and maybe even pick up uh, my, some mana. Ooh, mana stone. 
Nice. And Hackmanite. Ooh, awesome. And did I loot you? Yeah, I think I did. Hopefully these guys aren't going to be here again in the future. Um, and then we should be able to pop out right here. And then we're, we're beyond the ghost path. This I'm, I'm really happy that we <laughs> that all worked out. Nice. Okay. So the... <clears throat> I think it was called the Mansion Cellar or something like that. I don't actually know... Here, let's turn off my lantern. Uh, I don't actually know what's there. And I think what I'm going to do is we're going to investigate other things and then maybe come back to that one if we still have a bit of time. Um, I think we've basically... <laughs> okay, what I could do is uh, if I went in with uh, with my with lots of good stamina and stuff like that. Wait a minute. Okay. I'm, I'm worried that... Oh, actually, let's hit you up. Anything interesting? No, just berries. Okay. Um... I'm I'm interested in the what's beyond those ghosts, and uh, we should be able to we should be able to deke past them if we have our stamina up and all that other stuff. But for now, I want to go check out the Thunderbird because that looks really cool. We saw um, we did see something very similar to that in one of the other biomes. Was it the? Was it the forest? I can't remember, to be honest with you. It was one of the other biomes, though. They had a bunch of these. But this one, this one looks different. It looks bigger. Like the other one, it had stuff that looked like like the, this little one here. And if I remember correctly, you couldn't do anything with it, right? Here, let's get this. Because, uh, yeah, you can't... It, I don't think there's anything you can do with this. It's basically just a set piece. And then... Oh, I wonder what's up on the other side of that, that, that gate there. There's there's that one there. See, that one's got a road leading up to it. But what's up here? So we'll have to... Oh. What is this? Talk to the cabal, cabal of Wind Altar. You feel the strange surge of wind blow through you. The wind of the Sherson East region recognizes you and will obey you if you command it. Really? Okay. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Whoa! What is this? This is an imp I can't go past here. I, it's not letting me. Can I go through here? Oh, yeah, yeah. See, it's not even letting me. Okay, so that doesn't exist. That's really neat. I. That is cool. Oh, I love the... I love the, 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 the imagery. That is... Here, I think... You know what? This is... This is... Here we go. <laughs> that is... That is awesome. <laughs> All right, let's go and check this out. I think this is another one of the little ones that doesn't have anything. Can I even go behind it? Yeah, I can. Okay. Can I go over here? I don't think... You know what? That looks like nothing. So let's just ignore it. And then over here, what do we got? Okay, we got another one of those down there. See, that is the first time... Oh, Hermit's House! Okay, let's, before we go into the Hermit's House... Let's just take a look around. So we've got some, we got a beach down there that we could do some cooking on if we had to and rest up. Still no uh, uh, butterflies that I've seen, but I haven't really been paying attention 100%. Let's get some more berries. And all right, let's check this out. So what, do I have to climb? Oh my God, okay. <laughs> Is this gonna, am I walking into danger? <laughs> okay, okay, okay. I should, oh, I guess I can't really be prepared, okay. Oh, let's turn on some light so we can light this place up a little bit. Well, this looks really cool. Okay, so we've got what looks like a marlin of some sort on the wall. We've got a dude cooking, and we've got a dude. Okay, now I don't know if... if um, see, the definition of hermit, I believe, is someone that lives alone. And how can you be a hermit if you've got what appears to be... It's like an older fella, whom I, I'm assuming is the, the hermit... And a younger fella, whom I'm assuming is the... Oh, this is... Oh, it's Agatha. Um, and it's... Oh, no, it's not a young... It's, a, it's an older lady. She's a maiden of the winds. Okay. How are you? Oh, she sounds nice. Oh. Oh, I want to buy something. Oh, you you sell... Oh. She's a... She sells... Oh, look at that. She sells... She's like... um, 
um, the uh, the apothecary or whatever it is, the one that sells. Yeah, oh, that's cool. Like she's got mana stones. What has she got? Astral potion. I don't know how to do that. A cold stone. I know. Firestone, hex cleanser. I'm not too worried about it at this moment. I know that one in termit pottage. Okay, I know those. All right, all right. Um, uh, I I need more life potions. By the way, I burned a lot of them out. Well, what's this? A scholar's attire. So this is like a magic user's the ability to get magic user, a master's staff. And uh, okay, all right, all right. I don't think I have anything extra. I mean, I could sell you Hackmanite. How much would you like for the fifty? You know, I could I could I could deal with that. That's pretty that's pretty good. Okay. Um I've got some mana stone. I'm gonna hang on to that because it's useful. And I think everything else I have is pretty useful too. So Conser confirm there we go. Alright, thank you for doing business with me. And what do we got here? Oh that is cool. And then we've got I'm gonna I think he's the main thing, so let's let's investigate this place before we get ourselves into trouble. Who knows? Maybe I'll piss him off and he's gonna want to leave want me to leave immediately and I won't have an opportunity to check this place out. So he's got like a wait a minute. Where does where does Is it Agatha? Where does Agatha sleep? Where does There's like a single bed here. Do you guys take turns with Oh my god, that's weird. Okay, well, let's not worry about it. Unless somebody sleeps on the table. Okay, let's talk to our friend here. Nothing over there. There's a vice. <laughs> that's, that's not a good sign. Okay. All right. He looks... <clears throat> Al, Adalbert the Hermit. Okay. Excellent. Oh, he sounds nice too. These guys are like super cool dudes. Okay, or uh, dudes and dudettes. A visitor. The, the Cabal shares its wisdom with those who respect the five winds. Reason, passion, fury, kindness... And the inside wind. Oh, okay. Listen to me. To use the spells I teach. Oh, he's a um, uh, what you call it? Like you, you can learn stuff from him. Uh, to use spells I teach, find the wind totems in every region. That's what we found outside, I think. Then you may use these spells in that region. The totems are taught by a bird statue. You'll recognize them. Yes. Okay. I want to train with you. So he's a full uh, with a with like a breakthrough point and the whole all that. Oh, this is cool. Oh, I I sold the. I, oh, I've got fifty points. I can buy something. Okay, so reveal soul. So reveal the bluish soul orb left by deceased thieves and adventurers. Certain spells must be cast in proximity to a soul. That sounds like necromancy. Okay, um, Call to Elements uh, grants you a boon that varies according to your location when you cast a spell. Cool. Mana Push, a spell which inflicts no damage but has high impact in a wide area in front of the caster, can be combined with other spells for powerful effects. See, now that sounds cool because what that can do is when you go to engage somebody, you can immediately put them off their footing uh, with that, and then, then basically you go in and you just keep smacking them. That is, uh, that I think would give you a huge advantage. Okay, what else do we have here? Weather tolerance. Hey, that's cool too. This dude's actually kind of awesome. Shamanic resonance. Reson residence. Shamanic resonance. Uh, the effect boons, you, uh, the effects of boons on you are increased. For example, a boon increase your fire resistance by 20 would increase it by 30. Oh, wow. Okay, so any of the boons, it would make it more impactful. That This is this dude's super cool. Vi the Sigil of Wind. Re uh, you required... Okay, the Activate Wind Altar. Uh, create a magic circle on the ground. Certain... Okay, so this is like the Sigil of Fire type thing. The fire thing. And then Infuse Wind. Uh, required Activate Wind Altar. Uh, increase the impact and attack speed of your melee weapon for three minutes. Your stamina burn increases more quickly, however. And then Conjure, a spell which does nothing on its own but can be combined with other abilities. Um, so if I were to reveal a soul, can I conjure it? Because conjure means, in necromancy, means to conjure a spirit, right? So is that what that does? That's really cool. All right, I'm going to, you know what I'm going to do? 
<clears throat> I'm going to basically, I'm going to remember this. And I, well, I have it in here. We're just going to do do, 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 and then this, and then this, and then that, and then that. And then I think this is actually really cool. And I might buy one of these. I think this reveal soul one sounds kind of awesome. Uh, a certain, yeah, I can't do anything with it, but I'm going to, okay, you know what? I'm going to have to, hmm. Okay, I'm going to do this one, actually, because uh, a boon would be kind of nice. Or do I want mana? No, mana push. This is the one that, uh, yeah, 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 this is the one that's cool. Okay, there we go. We've got mana push. Sweet. All right, dude. Well, thank you very much. So there you go. That's This is the uh, the hermit. Oh. Okay, we'll have to remember him because uh, some of those those abilities, they they look really good. They... um. That almost like I think he he, you can use up to three of your your skills like to the you can use up three breakthroughs, and his actually sound really neat. Okay, let's turn off the lantern. Uh, so all right, I think we've got a bit of time. So what I'm going to do is, well, uh, let's go take a look and let's let's go try that that again. But this time we're gonna go in uh, we're gonna go in heavy. We're going to actually do this. Um, we know sort of what we're dealing with, so we'll go in a little bit more uh, more prepared. Oh, by the way, you know what I should do? I don't think this is going to work for... Uh, let's have that, and that'll get some mana back. And then um, I have fishy stuff on me. Oh, pottage. Let's have the pottage. That'll actually increase my uh, mana regen, right? Yeah. Mana recovery, 0.25 per second. If I also... Wait a minute. Mana recovery, 3, 0.25 per second. What if I had... Um, I've got some uh, poto pirat, pirat, which is a fish-based recipe. Oh, that one actually does uh, health as well. Health recovery for... Wow. Okay, so I can live with that. There we go. All right. And... Uh, do I have anything I could drink astral potion? Is there anything I have that would actually... No, no, I'm recovering mana slowly, so that's fine. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. All right. Now, this time, I'm going to go in prepared. So, let's get in front of the, uh, the thingamabobber here. And... <sighs> let's see. Well, the first thing I'm going to do is uh, here. Let's let's actually do a protection, which, if I remember correctly, is uh, four and two. Right. Okay. And then let's go back to the this thing right here. You know what? Why don't I do the? Uh, do I have enough? Oh, I don't think I have enough. I'm slowly getting it back. Oh, the, the mana, the push. I don't think that's going to work for these guys, though. Is it going to work for them? Skill slots. Uh, let's go with... I can't use the bow anyways, so let's go with a skill. And let's do this one here. Mana push. And that's E. Okay. All right. And then let's go... Let's, uh, let's get that out. Let's get that out. The E is going to be the whatchamacallit. And then the last thing I want to do is we're going to use an ice rag because uh, ghosties don't like ice as far as I can tell. Okay. All right. Okay, now E is my mana push. I don't know if we've got enough mana for it. I think we do, but we're going to find out. Okay, where are they? There's one right there. All right. How big is this place? Get, get some land. Okay, nothing here. Okay. Hey, guys, how you doing? Yeah, don't mind me. What else is there? Uh-huh. Okay, we've got uh, we've got that. Okay, that's cool. Hey, guys. Hey, guys. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know. I know. Ooh, there's something right there, too. Oh. And is there something? I don't know what that is. Can I go up the stairs? What's up the stairs? Oh, there's a junk pile. Okay. Oh, they're following me. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Okay, so uh, E. Oh, oh, that didn't do as near as much as I thought it should. 
Okay, that's cool. That's cool. All right. Okay, that's it. Give me a... Okay, go ahead. All right. Ah, eh. There's two of them. This is terrible. Oh. Oh, they're, 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 just, they're just hammering me. Oh. <laughs> I don't think I can handle the two of them at the same time. <sighs> All right. <laughs> Whatever. Oh, my goodness. Uh... Okay, this is the pain. Okay, I'm back in Sierzo. All right, well. <laughs> there. Oh, I was right. Look at that. Winter's here. Uh, which means that I'm going to have to change out my uh, my gear anyways because uh, it's actually it's cold. So I'm going to have to. Well, I mean, I'm going to have to actually think about what I want to do next. Um, do I want to? Here, let's get some water. And uh, we're just, let's get some water and do some other things. I think I'm at the point right now. We've basically checked out, um, for the most part, I think we've got done pretty well all of the uh, the Shersonis. The only thing we haven't done is, well, here, let's, let's just do this. Let's go, let's go outside the gate for a second, because it's the only way we're going to be able to... Uh, Man, my dude is, like, in seriously bad shape. Okay, let's go out here. This is the only way I can look at the map. Uh, I was just hoping to do some a bit more exploration of the Shersonese, but I... I mean, we could do Vandeval. But I think... I think there's something else that I need to do. So, we, we've, we've done the Cabal of the Wind Tower. We've... Uh, oh, we didn't do the Ancient Ruins. Hmm. We we cleared the bandit camp. We've done this bandit camp. We haven't done Vandeval or these ancient ruins. They look that's Vandeval. No, there's Vandeval. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That Vandeval. We've done that Vandeval. I haven't done it. Uh we've done the vigil pylon. I think I think I need to uh I think I need to fish or cut bait. I need to I need to decide what it is that I want to do, which of the paths. We've got the three paths that we can follow. We can pledge to Alat, we can pledge to Levant, or we can pledge to the Blue Chamber Collective, uh, Rissa. And so I think we've uh, I think we've hit the point. By the way, did I get I got Gabberry wine? Okay. I think we've hit the point where we need to figure out what it is that we need to do next. So that's where we are, and uh, I need to think about it. I am heavily leaning towards Levant. But I could go, uh, but I'm, well, okay, let me put it this way. I'm leaning slightly towards Levant, but I really could go with almost anything. I'm not, I am absolutely not, not certain what I, what it is that I want to, uh, what I want to do. So, <sighs> big decisions for little Ono, <laughs> big decisions, but I think for now, He's extremely exhausted. Oh, by the way, that push thing, that actually worked really well. If it was just one dude, I probably could have handled it. But the, because there's two of them, they can double team me. So, yeah, not a good situation. Uh, I think we want to go to sleep for a long time. Actually, here, that's, we're going to... He's really exhausted. He's going to repair some stuff. And uh, there we go. All right, I think this is a good place to stop. Um, I need to think about what it is that we want to do in the future. And yeah, I'm not going to go back to that cellar, by the way. Not, not right now. Um, I need to be a little more prepared. I'm, I'm still overmatched for two ghosts like that. So, uh, if I could separate them out, then that would be good, but I don't think I can. And the only other thing I can think of is if I were just to run through there, not kill them and just grab as much as I can hit the junk pile. I probably could have done that, but that's okay. All right, well, decisions, decisions. I think this is a good place to stop. Thank you very much, everyone. Until next time, you all have yourselves a great day. Bye-bye. Oh, oh, by the way. Uh, look at that cash. <laughs> Pretty good, huh? All right, bye.